right. once you yeah once you start going training camp you really don't know what's uh, and what day it is and what's the happening this in the is world mid october <laughs> we'll take that uh getting better still should be that way a few injuries and that's not a good thing we have some guys missing uh, some valuable reps, but uh, that's training camp a little bit. At the same time, some of the young players that need reps, getting better and better, uh, getting more situations in. Tomorrow we get in full pads, so from here on out, you know, things will change a little bit. But please, where we are after five days. How did it feel to have Ricky Smalling out there today? It's good. Uh, you need to get back out here, you know. Press me. There's a lot to do. A lot of mental work. Um, you know, just figuring out how to how we practice, too. It's one thing to be working out, uh, you know, you own a little bit, but it's a difference out here. So it's good to get him here. We have everybody here now, which is a good thing. What's his schedule like the next couple of days? You got to catch up with everybody else. Yes, he has to. Uh, with just playing football, uh, you know, NCAA road, he has two days of just, you know, in helmet only. And from there, we'll get his shoulder pads on, too. So Saturday will be another good day. He'll have a little, little bit of time after that to catch up mentally. You know, the players are off Sunday. And, and hopefully about Monday, he'll start looking more like the Ricky Smalling. That, that we well, he's the first to commit to you. What's, what's he mean to, to this team and to this current team? He's an awful lot just by that statement. He bought in early on. Of course, we bought into him early on. Ricky's a good football player. He's going to be able to help us win a lot of games during his career. But you need to get that first practice in, first week of practice, all of that. Uh, again, we, it's about getting an entire football team here, and we'll start getting him better. How do you feel about your wide receiver group in general, Levy? I feel better with him here. Yes. You know, adding another player. Uh, our numbers in. eventually will be up, you know, higher than they are right now. But, you know, when you have – Mike Duty coming back, adding a guy like Ricky Smalling into the mix. Our freshmen have done, you know, Kamani Green, Kendall Smith. All those guys have contributed with our one, our one player, Malik Turner here. So I feel pretty good about it. What, what is Dorsey? Is Dorsey a tight end, a hybrid, a wide receiver? Well, we're just gonna, uh, we're not gonna really say right now. Yeah. Let everybody else kind of figure out where, where they, how, and how they should play him. But um, he's at cross. I mean, uh, you know, a guy that could line up in line. Also, is pretty comfortable outside. Mm -hmm. Today, he was making quite a bit of plays uh, spread out. Larry Boyd didn't participate. Today. It was an uh, injury or just held out after four days on? Holding out a freshman? Is that what you have? <laughs> nah, if, if a player isn't practicing, he hasn't been just throughout. There's, we don't hold players out here. So that's a general rule. If you see somebody out, he has something bothering uh, you know, Larry, nothing serious. And if there is something serious, I'll tell you. I'll let you know that too. But right now, just kind of grind of training camp a little bit, I'll tell you. How do you like this weather? I mean, I mean, it's uncharacteristically cool. Would you like it to be warmer, or is this is this good? Uh, we had, what, five weeks ago? We'll get our warm days in there. So anytime you can have weather like this, with practice. Uh, this is where we play. I mean, seven games here. It's going to be cool, quite a few of the games. So I'd look at every situation that comes up in training, preparing you for the year. It's a good thing.